Hello, my name is Abe, and welcome back to The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. Don't even want to talk about the last run, which was a challenge run attempt. It's garbage. Azazel. Azazel. Greedier mode again. We had a really good Azazel run last time we tried this. A tears upgrade is always welcome. We had a really good attempt last time, but we couldn't really make it work. Let's try it again here. I do like that there's a demon judgment, because that means if we can play him, I would love to. We got the Fool. We got Algiz. Algiz means we can play him, so I, I will sacrifice half a heart and then play him with the Algiz rune and hopefully get a payout. Being able to pick up a deal with the devil item or something right now would be amazing. And you know what? We get a damage plus range upgrade, which is perfect. Perfect for me. Yes. Good. Excellent. Let's go. An enemy spawn on the barrel and explode. Lovely. Oh, and on that barrel too. Don't like that there's a champion here that's gonna explode. But we managed to make it work without getting hit. Yeah, last time we had like triple shot plus high damage plus uh, a lot of range upgrades. There was something else that we had that I can't remember. Something else that was uh, interesting. That's okay. Man, I hate spiders. But at least with Azazel, you have this wall in front of you that can hopefully kill them fast enough. Oh, oh we're not going to take damage. I thought we would. I don't know how they exploded, but I very much appreciate it. It's okay, just spiders. We can fly, so let's definitely hide over the rocks when we can. If I can kill enemies near me, I will. Otherwise, I'm just going to try to focus on spiders. And it worked out nicely. Those diglets managed to pop up near me, making it easy to kill. Making them easy to kill. I'm going to buy a key. We would need to go into the item room to see what's in there. Anyways, we have two bombs that we can use to reroll if we need to. It's Lil Gertie. Which is not very good, but I suppose it is technically a damage upgrade of some sort. I don't like it because it's very inconsistent and doesn't do very much damage either, but better than nothing, I suppose. Yeah, come down here and, like, drop a bomb. I want to see if I can get them to, like, blow open the, the pots, but instead they're just going to kill themselves. It's fine. Do we want an item? Honestly, maybe an HP upgrade so we can take a deal with the devil. Two cents. Blow up the machine. I'll take in HP, HP plus luck, and we'll take a deal with the devil if we can. I'll do exactly what I said I might want to do. This should be pretty easy. These guys are just going to chase me down. Deal with the devil is two red chests. Unfortunate. And with nothing good in them. Okay, we're going to go down to the next floor. I don't see any reason to stay. We can buy a key on the next floor and go into the item room immediately. Yep. Uh, we did get a damage upgrade, a small damage upgrade in the form of synth oil. So there is that. Ah, this is good. Box. Bomb, key, pulse worm. Does that work with the brimstone laser? No, so it's just like a reroll target, basically. Use the pill, are you a wizard? Does not affect brimstone laser, good. Creep shots. You know, am I gonna get, like, can I pick up a D6? Can I reroll all of these bad items I don't want? Two spear arts, nice. I might as well take them now so that I can So that I can uh, keep the black heart intact. Paralysis. I do want to use judgment. I just want to wait for a good time to use him. Let's use him right judgment. now. It is a demon judgment. We can play him. We have some red hearts on the floor that we can pick up. And maybe get another deal with the devil item. Retrovision. 
very annoying. Yeah, I like the red hearts in this creep shot room. Because it means we can get a bunch of plays on the Demon Judgment. And when we get 15 cents, probably we are just going to buy Squeezy. It's a tears upgrade, which is nice. And the two spirit hearts is pretty good as well. Yeah. Card. Card is Justice. We are going to pop that. Keep playing him. With two bombs, I can actually blow up the pots and the judge or the um, shopkeepers as well, which is something that I'm going to be very interested in doing. I think we're out of HP on the floor that we can take for free, so hopefully this does pay out. Oh. Let's blow up these guys. Two cents. Let's blow up these guys here. I don't think that's going to blow up the demon judgment. Nope. All right, let's fight. That is a fast bomb fly. Oh, magic mush. Yo, I kind of did that on purpose, waiting for uh, the fly to get there, and I'm glad I did, because we got magic mush for free. He hallelujah. Hallelujah. Okay. Let's not get excited, though. Still got to win. Range is start. I don't even know what shot what blew up there. I guess something spawned. Uh, range is starting to be pretty good. We can actually hit enemies, hopefully explosive enemies, without hurting ourselves. Which is what I was about to say before we killed some sort of an explosive enemy and, killed and hurt ourselves. Luckily, that just spawned one spider and then dissipated the portal. All right, we got money. Let's pick up Squeezy. Get that tier upgrade. And actually, also play this guy. Because Magic Mushroom heals you. Virus is nice. It's a slight damage, or a slight speed downgrade, but our speed is all right uh, without it, or with it. Pick up Squeezy. That is a range and tiers upgrade. I think we'll get enough money for it. I want Mr. Dolly. Mr. Dolly is exactly what you want with Azazel. Let's you fire faster and also at a, uh, a larger distance. Now, I think these bombs do contact damage, but maybe not. I've heard tale that they do. Try not to get hit here. Bring as much HP into the deal with the devil as possible. Although we might get a deal with the angel because uh, I guess we didn't take any deals with the devil uh, yet. Hopefully we will. Give me real brimstone. I'll take it. Damn it. I mean, an HP upgrade's not that bad, but I was hoping for something a little bit better. Alright, so it looks like occasionally we fire off a slow bullet, which I guess is alright. Nothing else here for us. I might as well get back up to full health and then go. Okay. We got some good damage right now in really good range. But our items are a bit lacking. We don't really have any good synergies going on. This is really good. That, not so much. It might make us mom, like with mom transformation, but it might not. Terra Cloth I like, key for free. Temperance, that's going to be a Demon Judgment, and we can Terra Cloth it and get two Demon Judgments. That is something I'm very interested in. We also have a lot of keys for free, which I do like, because we shouldn't need to buy any from this point forward. Yeah, right now we are really good at both waves and bosses. We're pretty good at waves because we have good damage, good range, good ability to hit. We're good at bosses because we can hit hard and really hard when we need to. Discreet bursts. Yeah, give me zombies. Zombies are no problem. Yeah, more zombies. More zombonies. I 
I didn't see anything spawn. I thought I saw something spawn and then immediately like burrow into the ground. So I wanted to wait for a second to see what it was. 15 cents, we can pick up Tarot Cloth. It gives us a card, which is two of clubs, which I'm just going to use to get like four bombs. Two of yep. clubs. We're going to use Temperance. Let's do it by this guy. Two Demon Judgments. Very nice. I should probably double play one of them to get a payout as fast as possible. We got a syringe, very good. Speed plus range. And now we have spun. And are you a wizard, which we don't need, but spun is nice. Damage upgrade. And mom's bottle pills. Which is a space bar item that we have or need. Are you a wizard? Pills. Okay, 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 okay. Black heart, very nice. I did not expect that from that bomb. Might as well pick up the HP. And we'll pick up coin first, because now we are mom. And we got pills. Retrovision, paralysis, range up, X Lax. Range up is really good, so we're going to be hoping to get a lot of range upgrades or. Pills that we haven't seen yet. Like, good pills that we haven't seen yet. Full health. Balls of steel. 48 hour million energy. I don't need to worry about the button. I was worried for a second. I'm like, don't hit the button. We don't need to worry about hitting the button. There's no button. Button's gone. But look at our range. It's ridiculous. I love getting range upgrades as a Zazel. Makes it actually work. Yeah, freeze his hand. There we go. Oh, he died. I don't even know how he died, but he did. Guardian Angel is okay. If we fight this guy, we get a key piece, which is kind of pointless. We can blow up the fires. I'd rather save the bombs for something a little bit more useful. It's very disappointing that we're getting these deals with the angel. I want to get rid of my HP. I want big damage upgrades. I'm not getting big damage upgrades, am I? We will blow up this guy. No reason to not. A nickel's good. The key is okay. We already have three, which is enough to take us for the rest of the game, I think. I thought that bomb would have hit the machine. I guess not. D1. D1 doubles a consumable. We could double a card and then keep using it. Or use it once and then use it again. Speed plus shot speed we don't need. I think I'm just going to... You know, I'm going to put a couple of coins in this. Blank card. Blank card could be really good. Blank card two of diamonds would win it. So I'm going to take blank card and then go. If we can get a two of diamonds, a Yera, a Algiz, then we can probably guarantee a victory on the on the greed fight. More damage is good. Evil range shot speed is fine. Our range is now 46. I don't know what that is in terms of other characters, but it seems pretty good. That's a damage upgrade, so I'm gonna definitely be interested in that. We got more pills, retrovision, speed up, which we don't need, but that's fine. Um, yeah, let's let's get out of here. Do some waves. My range is so good. I kind of messed that up a little bit. Brimstone ghosts. Thought I would be able to kill the Brimstone Ghost, but that's okay. We don't need to don't need to kill him immediately. We can wait a second. Just kill as many things as you can. Two Brimstone Ghosts. I'm glad I didn't get hit by the second one, but I didn't expect him at all. Okay, all of those little underground guys have been killed. Let 
more brimstone ghosts. Oh, the range is so good. Get out of here, ghost. All right, no cards. I am gonna buy the damage upgrade. It's speed plus damage, but still damage. So it is worth getting, I believe. I'll, I'll spend 15 cents on it. There's another boss here somewhere. Okay, oh my god. Luckily I was just inching forward and avoided him barely. Okay, more deals with the angel. Stop giving me deals with the angel. <laughs> this is exactly what I don't want. Oh my god. I want deals with the devil. I've got so much HP. Why? Might as well try to get a secret room. Oh, wait a minute. That's a two room charge. Ah, I think this is better. Jesus, juice damage plus range, very small range upgrade, 0 0.25. The damage was a little bit better. Range, range down, down. range is still fine. I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited could actually ruin the game for us. Probably not ruin, you know, but it could. It's bad. It is really bad. Void could be interesting because we can suck up blank card, but I don't know. did get a card. With I'm excited, randomly, uh, a room will get sped up. And if it gets sped up, enemies will move twice as fast. It's already happened on this floor, so we're just gonna have to move as fast as we can. Just keep moving. Don't let enemies get near you. Yeah, this is uh, not good, but I can't really, I can't prevent I'm excited from working here. The invisible enemies are still hitting me. There, there's nothing I can do to stop taking that damage from invisible enemies. I'm excited is a absolute garbage pill and on this mode, disastrous as well. Get out of the room and hope that I'm excited doesn't persist when you leave because Jesus. Adversaries. Good, good stuff. Easy fight. Deal with the devil. We're gonna take. I mean, at this point, what do I take? Anything? Nothing? Not useful, not useful, not useful. Damn it. Damn it! I think we take Void and Varicose Veins. Varicose Veins hopefully does a Brimstone shot when we take damage. Void, we can suck up Blank card and actually get some, uh, some good use out of it. So we'll suck it up. The tower. We blank carded the tower. We rerolled as well. Got some money. Let's get out of here. All right, let's go. There's not gonna be a, sh a um, item room here for free. And this is the last floor. Hopefully we get some good stuff. This is not good. <laughs> this is not good. Okay, Varicose Veins does work the way I expect it to, which is nice. And we are somehow getting black hearts from uh, killing enemies. Don't know how that's happening, but I appreciate it. I kinda just wanna take damage and run at all the en enemies, but I'm not gonna do that. I think we have a good chance. 
but Azazel has to get really close to the boss to hit him, and that puts you in range of a lot of his annoying attacks, especially when he's in his second phase of the greed fight. So I don't know. I don't know. That's a regular donation machine. That's not a... a It's not a, a, a greed donation machine. Yeah, I'm gonna tower that. I'm gonna tower that and then buy some items. Or play that judgment or something, I don't know. I'll decide what I'm gonna do with the money in a minute. I just knew I wanted money. So that was the first wave. I am slow, thanks to war. Uh, Let's fight the boss. Yeah, uh, stain anyways. Not the boss. This boss. Good, you're dead. We shoot quickly, we have good range, but I don't know. I think we need more. This could do it, actually. I think we take all of them. We should have a decent amount of HP. Rotten Baby is going to be good. Ceremonial Robes is a damage upgrade. Mostly max HP. And then I think... I think we just spend money re-rolling at this point. And I hope that we can get something amazing. Like Dull Razor is what we want. Wait, you, it's, a, it's, a, it's a two room charge? I thought you could use it infinitely. I thought you could use it infinitely. Well, that makes it substantially worse. Can't, can't actually buy anything now. I'm below the uh, amount of money I would need. So at this point, find a good card or rune. All the void gives us right now is a blank card that's useless. Can't afford any of that. Come on, give me a card. Give me one card. Give me one card. Give me a cheap card. Oh god, I can't afford anything. Nope, there goes the card. Um. I can't blow up the uh, donation machine. I get an HP upgrade. Put a penny into this. Take Dull Razor. And then leave. Oh man. Don't give me a penny. Don't give me a penny. Oh man. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Couldn't break. Couldn't really get any good items. But we have high range, decent damage, varicose veins, dull razor, which we can use literally once. The monster doesn't even give me money anymore. Two spear hearts. I guess it's fine. That's what Dull Razor does, and we can't use it again ever. It lets you trigger effects that would happen when you take damage, but without actually taking damage. Somehow we're getting black hearts, which might be the thing that actually keeps me alive in this run here. Although we're actually doing really decent damage. Yeah, damage output is pretty good. We did kill one of those hearts, even though I think it had already done the sound effect for it coming into his body and getting sucked in by him. He's rushing me down. Bombs. Bombs are no problem. Just let them go off. Okay, take care of the keys. When you take damage, just run in there and kill all the coins and shit. I think we can do this. It's taking a while. But we're doing pretty well. We're doing pretty well. Kill the coins. Coins are so annoying. 
I don't know how I didn't get hit there. Jesus. Fired the wrong direction. More coins? Kill a couple coins, make yourself some room, then focus back on greed. He's almost dead. We've actually got a lot of HP going into the next phase. Okay. This is where it gets tough. Whenever he shoots, we just gotta move out of his way. Because him shooting is dangerous. Because it's explosions. It's always explosions. This is annoying because I can't actually hit him. Try to get Gertie in there, it didn't work. Ah, oh, I shouldn't have been standing there. That's my my bad. We got no money. This is not a donation run, this is a kill him run. Oh, I stood under him. We do good damage with varicose veins though. We might just be able to tank him. I prefer not to. Don't be under him, don't be under him. under him. Get out of the way as soon as you freaking can. Behind him is for the best. I think we're gonna win with Varicose Veins really doing a good job helping me out here. I wish we could get Dull Razor to work, but I guess if it if it had a chance to pay out and it was a, a zero room charge item or a one room charge item, maybe that would be overpowered because you get infinite gimpy payouts, infinite payouts from... Uh, that satchel item that gives you money? Or not money, but uh, gives you anything. When you take damage. But yeah, fanny pack, that's what it is. But yeah, good run. We had a ton of HP, decent enough damage, varicose range, <laughs> range varicose veins, and good range. So that's how we were able to actually succeed in that run. Good run! I had fun with it. I kind of wish that we could have gotten in some cooler synergies or something, but that's okay. Uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Like the video if you enjoyed it, subscribe for more, and I hope to see you here again for the next run of The Binding of Isaac.